and welcome to another video of Walk of the Wild Side and I'm here in Blackpool. It's a bit of a breezy Monday evening here in Blackpool. We're just about lighting up time. It's, uh, what, around about half past eight on a Monday, the 19th of August. Look at that view of the tower there down. Foxhall Road's pretty awesome, isn't it? That's a new Philly sports bar just over there. We've got a chippy on the corner, Sea Fresh, it says. Blackpool's finest traditional fish and chip. I've not been in there actually. I'll have to check it out. I'm just here by the Markellies. Yes, Markellies. It used to be the Foxhall. Well, this is this area here is the Foxhall area, of course, one of the oldest parts of Blackpool. And uh, I just thought we'd have a quick look around here and the promenade and see how busy it is on a Monday. It feels a bit like the summer's over. It feels like there's a bit of a chill in the air tonight bit windy been some rain today so what do you think i still think the whole <laughs> let me know in the comments are the kids back at school in a week or so i don't know let me know so but let's have a look on the promenade and see what it's like shall we okay so here we go we're just looking straight out there Look at that, that looks pretty awesome, doesn't it? Look at that. Very heavy cloud, no chance of seeing the sunset tonight, but let's have a look around, shall we? Check it out, Mark Ellis. They're doing well, you know, here. Yeah. I watched a uh, random and desperate video. They went in there and it was absolutely banging in there, you know. They know how to uh, make a success of a pub. But anyway, just here, I haven't been to this place, but this is Prime Burger, and this is the, the other one pound burger place. Yeah, check it out, yeah. And someone told me, I think I saw a video or something, where he put his prices up to two pounds for the air show. So that was a bit naughty, wasn't it? So we're getting a little look at Blackpool on the main drag on a Monday. I'll just look at that view out there, though. Looks pretty awesome, doesn't it? Like I say, we're just lighting up now. They've actually got the illuminations on. Look at this. Wow. We're getting a bonus in this video, aren't we? I'll tell you what we'll do. Central Pier's going, of course. Got a tram going here, there. We've got another chippy here. Fish and chips. Food to go. I wonder what they're like. So many places to get fish and chips in Blackpool, isn't it? It is quite windy. It's quite a wind tonight, but the wind is coming from the south. So it's quite a warm wind. Yeah, and we've got another Markelly's down here. Can you believe it? We've got another Markelly's. Just barely a minute away, walking distance from the other one. <laughs> Look at that. Wow, that's Markelly Central. And uh, we're now on to, on to Foxhall Road. Bit of work going on here. Look, wonder what's going on there. This is Gaieties. That's not open at the moment. Zane Pizza Kebab there. Plenty of places to get something to eat round here. It does feel a bit like a back alley round here, but it's quite lively. It is quite lively. Loads of hotels as well down there. Very narrow streets here in Foxhall. It's got a lot of character. Oh, that's a lifeboat, isn't it? I didn't realise. The lifeboat, yeah. And that's a, that, that pub there is very, very popular. Yeah, it is. But here's a little look down this way to Woodstock. Look at that view there. That's the Ardwick, the Ardwick pub down there. Very popular pub in Blackpool. I've been in myself, the Ardwick. Get yourself in the Ardwick if you come into Blackpool. But we've got the bright lights tonight. Everything's lit up. We've got the illuminations as well. Let's, let's get back to the promenade and have a look, shall we? I suppose it's a bit of a filler video, yeah, this one, line, really. Uh, I just thought I'd show you what's going on in Blackpool. I'm just heading across the road from Pat's 10p bingo there. I wasn't expecting the lights to be on, so check it. These look quite nice, actually, these lights, yeah. Look at this. Check it out, Blackpool Illuminations on a Monday, yeah. And yeah, we had them on just the other night, on the Saturday night, if you saw my eight. live stream, for the 10k and the 5k foot. That did really well, by the way, yeah. Yeah, that video, yeah. We had the limit. All the promenade was shut off 
before the race. On, so then, anyway, let's turn the camera on, shall we? Yeah, I quite like those. Those illuminations there. Here's a little look at Pat's 10p bingo. Oh, come on. Wouldn't you just love to be here in Blackpool right now playing your bingo? Plenty of places to play bingo, of course. Don't forget CJ's prize bingo at Happy Days. They work hard here in Blackpool. Let's have a look at the central. I'll tell you what, let's have a look over here, shall we? Come on, let's have a look at the sea. It looks absolutely awesome. Just look at this, wow. That looks absolutely epic. The sound and the look of those clouds as well. They're very, very thick clouds out there tonight. But it's not, it's not bad. The wind is coming, like I said, the wind is actually coming from the south, which is. Uh, quite unusual we normally get the winds coming from the southwest uh, you look at the big wheel the, the central piers rocking again I said in a previous video that I believe that the piers particularly the central pier and the south pier have recaptured the atmosphere that the pleasure beach has lost you know that atmosphere of loads of people just walking in there and going on a ride buying the tickets going on the big wheel going on the waltzer and just having to walk around and not having to pay to go on it like you do at the Pleasure Beach. You have to pay something like £50 to go in the Pleasure Beach. So if you rock up in Blackpool and you're not planning to go to the Pleasure Beach, but you happen to stumble upon it and then you find out that you've got to pay £50 to get in on the day. Well, how many people are going to go for that? But the piers like the central pier here you can just rock up and go in and, and go on the big wheel and go on the waltz there and go on the, the the rides that throw you up and down and and the south pier as well with this big swing ride yeah you can do it on the piers the piers have got that atmosphere they've got it that the pleasure beach has lost tell me what you think in the comments am i right or am i right <laughs> Check it out, the central pier looks awesome, doesn't it? All lit up there. Um, you know, I get quite a lot of people asking me, where's the one pound burger? <laughs> I still get lots of people asking me, it couldn't be easier. So there's the central pier. You simply go across the road, down there, two streets down on your right hand side, and that's where it is. And just over here, we've got happy days. I think I can hear Pete on the bingo over there. Check them out if you're coming to Blackpool. If you like playing bingo, get yourself in happy days. But there's plenty of choice in Blackpool. You don't, you know, there's uh, so many places. It's a place for fun is Blackpool. In all weathers as well. Look at these, these illuminations here. What do you think of these? I think this is where they spend all the money, isn't it? They spend all the money on these. And they basically get a string of lights to do the rest, what do you reckon? <laughs> they do look quite nice, these, these ones here. Um, but also, don't forget, they've got the tableaus up. You know, the big tableaus. Check out the lander. Is that the one that me and the map master went on? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, never again. My goodness. The stuff that he gets me to do, honestly. There you go, look at that. That looks pretty awesome, doesn't it? Blackpool Illuminate. I was not expecting to see the Blackpool Illuminations on tonight. So there you go. A bit of a bonus for you on a Monday night. Well, I can hear music all over the place. I can hear bingo going on as well. Yeah, and that was Blackpool on a Monday evening. 19th, is it the 19th of August? Or? I'm losing track of the dates. So there you go, a quick video for you. Um, I hope you like it. If you do, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one.